Hey guys, it's Rainer from the USAF Mod, and I wanted to uh, take a sec to show you around our new GPS system that we're going to be uh, releasing with 1.0. Um, first off, I want to get it set up with some JDAMs here. And we got some GBU 31s, some GBU 38s. I'm going to go ahead and load up some uh, GBU 53s as well. Actually, 39s. All right, that should work. All right, let's get in the air and uh, engage some targets. All right, so I have this paused here, and I'm going to go ahead and scroll wheel to GPS guidance system. And as you can see, we have our GPS dialog here. So first up, you just got to find the uh, location on the map that you want to engage. I'm going to engage this intersection right here. Now there's several ways you can uh, designate your target. You can just simply left click with no modifiers to set a temporary target and then you can mark that target. It'll turn black and you will have one of your targets in the list over here. To designate you'll want to click the target then and as you can see it's red indicating that the weapon release will attempt to engage this target. Uh, there's some shortcuts you can use in this dialog to uh, speed up the process. I'm going to delete this target here. You can hold control and left click to immediately drop and designate a target. You can drop multiple targets and it will designate the most recent. And then once you have multiple targets down, you can hold alt to select the closest target to your cursor within 500 meters. Uh, or you can always come over here to the list and uh, pick which one you'd like to engage. Uh, then you have your coordinate entry right here, and we can enter a grid. Let's say 0, 7, 0, 5 by 0, 9, 0, 2. And we have, this is a, uh, a toggle right here. You can either select upper left or center of the uh, entered grid coordinates. Uh, to put the target in the uh, respective position. So then once the uh, grid is entered, we're going to hit mark grid chords, and you can see we have a new target here at the selected coordinates, which you can then select with all click or selecting the list. Uh, then you have your angle of impact. Default's 45 degrees for a nice smooth uh, angle of attack. You can go all the way up to 90, or you can come down to 10 if you like. I'm going to leave it at 45 and see how that does. Alright, so one more way you can uh, toggle between your targets is you can go into Options, Controls, Configure Add-ons, and go to USAF GPS. And you're going to see two actions here which uh, select the next and previous GPS targets. That way you can uh, quickly switch between target points and ripple off uh, multiple weapons at a time. Alright, so back in the uh, GPS interface, I'm going to go ahead and uh, shift click on the location so I can see it with my personal marker. I'm going to close the interface and enable our simulation again. Alright, there it is, 1.4 clicks, 12 o'clock. I'm going to switch over to my GP, GBU 39s to begin with. And actually, I'm going to go ahead and get my target pod on target so we can watch the fireworks. There we go. All right. Pickle. And splash. Good stuff. All right, hope that helps you guys out. Uh, if you have any questions about the system, just let us know. Uh, there will be more documentation following the release of the mod, and we hope you guys enjoy. Thanks.